Hey there, if you're looking for a fun and easy way to earn rewards, including cash and prizes, check out the link in the video description. Welcome back to Reality Check, where we bring you the latest scoop on all things reality TV today. We're diving into the drama surrounding Summer House star Carl Rudd as he teases a potential reunion with ex Lindsay Hubbard. Stay tuned for all the juicy details. Season 8 of Summer House is coming to a close and the show has already been renewed for a ninth installment. Fans are now wondering how things between exes Carl Radke and Lindsay Hubbard will shake out at the reunion. Cast members like Jesse Solomon have called the reunion juicy and emotional, and now Carl is weighing in on what fans can expect. He had Amanda Batchela and Kyle Cook with him on the red carpet, to back him up as they reflected on the summer of 2023. This will be an especially hard reunion for Lindsay and Carl, as he called off their engagement last year. Of course, the events of season 8 were filmed while they were still together and also showed many of the issues they had. When OK Magazine asked Carl about how things went between him and Lindsay at the reunion, he had this to say, I think you'll see at the reunion. Carl continues, a lot gets covered. I thought Andy did an amazing job of trying to get everybody to clear the air and get everything off their chest, and I felt like that happened at the reunion. Amanda chimes in and says, and not to speak for you, Carl, but I feel like, while it's still airing and still happening like neither of them, are going to have that complete closure until all of this is just done. Despite the drama, Carl still appreciates the summer that the show captured. He says, I think there was a lot of fun that the group had this past summer, which I think you guys are seeing, and it's fun to see us like that because it actually was a lot of fun at times. But I wouldn't say for me, personally this was my favorite summer. Amanda echoed similar sentiments about the summer of 2023. She says, I felt like it was the most fun I've ever had during the summer. I remember once it ended and people asked, I was like, this was the best summer ever. She continues, watching it back, maybe it wasn't. I felt like we were so united as a house for the first time in a really long time, and that was nice. Kyle then says, I'll put it this way, not to spoil it, but on the very last day, we didn't just all walk to the car and go back to New York City. We kept on hanging out. We literally went to Montauk, which in eight years, we've never done. Recently, Carl also shared what he does for Kyle's beverage company, Loveaboy. He told Bravo's The Daily Dish, My signature in my email is I'm the Loveaboy advisor. Basically, what I'm focused on is business development, and bringing our non-alcoholic product to market. Carl goes on to share that he works part-time for the brand. I am working part-time, but only focused really on some of the things that I'm really good at, which is building relationships, marketing, and events, and really getting the non-alcoholic product into more stores, because right now it's only on our website. The main goal is getting it to more stores like Whole Foods, Total Wine, you know, big grocery stores, or even some of the smaller places around New York City. Fans can watch Summer House on Thursday nights on Bravo.